city has gone bankrupt. Birmingham City Council said it was unable to meet its debts, with officials calling a halt to all new spending, except for essential services. Our correspondent, Paul Hawkins, is there for us. Um, hi there, Paul. Now, it's hard to believe that the city, which hosted the Commonwealth Games only last year, has been declared bankrupt. What's going on? Yeah, so two, two main reasons for that, Julia. Firstly, uh, the council here has spent over a billion dollars trying to correct inequality in how much it pays its staff since 2012. And it's still got another $815 million to spend correcting that situation. So that's one thing. The other thing is that it's spent, or we will have to spend almost 100 or over $100 million trying to fix the IT system that was only meant to cost $23 million initially. When you factor in an increase in demand for public services provided by councils, including, of course, social care because the UK has an aging population and a fall in the funding from central government around about 40 percent over the past 10 years the end result is that Birmingham City Council has run out of money and so they're freezing uh, 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 spending on new services and instead of saying look we're gonna have to pay everything back and instead we will just provide the services that we are legally obliged to provide now they're talking to the UK government about what that will entail and how they're going to move forward but until a further announcement is made there's a lot of anxiety around here including at places like the library behind me about whether things like libraries uh, which they have to statutory they have to legally uh, provide whether those library services will be affected as we've been speaking to one birmingham city council who said there's real worry amongst his uh, amongst the people that he serves because nobody really knows how this is going to affect the daily lives of residents. Services, the most vulnerable, where the roads are bins are going to be collected, if council tax is going to go up. And the most vulnerable people in the city will be disproportionately affected. So the elderly, children with special education needs. And, and Paul, things are about to get even worse. Yeah, Birmingham City Council is not the first English local authority to announce that it's run out of money. There are a handful of towns across the UK that have already gone bankrupt. Effectively, because of the cuts in funding from central government, because of an increase in demand for their services, they've tried to invest, effectively gamble, put a lot of money into things like solar farms and property, and those investments have backfired. They don't have the resources to cushion those mistakes in their decision making so we are expecting another town stoke on trent in the midlands to also announce that it's run out of money in the near future and this is only a problem that's going to get worse for the prime minister rishi sunak as we head towards that general election in the uk sometime next year